She's a mother of four just getting gas Friday morning in Warren at Sunoco off 8 Mile. Now this is Joanna Winthrow in critical condition, shot three times, twice in the leg and once in the stomach in a totally random carjacking. He gave no opportunity whatsoever for the victim to comply with any demands, no opportunity to turn over her keys or to turn over her vehicle. He just started shooting. Now, 18 year old Javon Oliver, a senior in high school, charged for pulling the trigger. It came out in court after he allegedly shot her as she was laying on the ground. He stole Joanna's phone, keys, and drove off in her car. I think this is an appropriate case for a million dollar cash surety, no 10% bond. That's a $1 million cash bond for Oliver. Two other accomplices charged Monday in a Warren courtroom, including the alleged driver of the getaway vehicle during the carjacking, 27 year old Shakira Hayes. I didn't hurt anybody. Listen, and please, please, please just give me a chance. Please give me a bond and I will come to court and I will do everything I have to do. The judge setting Hayes bond at half a million dollars. And then there's 20 year old Michael McCall allegedly in the getaway car last Friday. This defendant once again made statements to police um, implicating his own involvement in the case, including the fact that the gun that was used in the shooting is his gun. He too with a high cash bond of $750,000. The trio was arrested over the weekend at a home off Stockton in Detroit. That's near Seven Mile and Hayes. Warren PD using facial recognition, pinging of cell phones to track them down. Joanna is still in the hospital recovering. She had another surgery on Monday. Her family has set up a fundraising page to help her four children during this tough time. You can find the link on our website. Reporting in Warren, Jessica Dupnak, Fox 2 News.